The ATS team are back on the road once again, and this time we've come to Cube Printing here in Bally Simon in Limerick to meet Limerick Hurling Manager, Sales Director here at Cube, and of course, patron of Cleonas Foundation, Mr. TJ Ryan. TJ, pleasure to meet you. Thank you for your time. Thanks, Ray. Um, yeah, I suppose the ATS last year, real challenge for myself and the group that I was with, and I'm looking forward to it again, I have to say, this year. Uh, Tell us a little bit about Cleonas Foundation. Yeah, look, Cleanest Foundation was founded here by Brendan and Terry Ring. Like, uh, I work with Brendan here in Cube. Um, obviously, they lost their daughter and set up the charity in her name. Um, I knew Clean very well myself. Um, Cleanest Foundation provides financial assistance to families of critically ill children throughout the country. Um, it started off locally here in Limerick. It's grown very much over the last number of years. Both Brendan and Terry have done a huge amount of work, and I'm glad to be a patron of a charity that provides such assistance at critical times in families' lives. I'm a father myself, I have two children and luckily enough they're both healthy and um, look, I'm quite happy to be able to provide assistance to any charity that provides assistance for those people in bad trouble at a bad time. Yeah, absolutely. Of course, Cleanest Foundation, they strive to to put on events and to raise money. And of course, that's what the association with Adair to Survive is. We're delighted to have Cleanest Foundation as our charity partner for the third year this year. And uh, we, we look forward to it. You took part in the event last year, TJ. Tell us all about it. How did you get on? What did you think? Yeah, we did it as part of a group for Cleanest Foundation last year. And it was it was fantastic. And as I said, the challenge was, it was immense initially. And first of all, as a group, um, we all wore the purple T-shirt for Cleanest Foundation. And this year, as part of the Purple Platoon we're doing the same again and look glad to do so and I think as part of a group as part of a team last year it was it was a real challenge it was tough going it was very enjoyable it was all of those things mixed in people were nervous at the start kind of didn't know what to expect and you know a lot of really high challenges throughout the course and you know I mean a seven and a half kilometer run not easy by any matter of means but the whole sense of team and kind of group work kind of really came to the fore and that kind of made it really enjoyable. So Cleonis Foundation really getting involved this year and from the registration point of view uh, it's very important that people register for the Purple Platoon. Tell us all about that. Yeah, if you log on to the page and you register through the, the Purple Platoon, like five euros of your registration fee goes straight to the charity, which is great. And we're looking for as many people as possible to come with us. You get a t-shirt, you'll be wearing a purple t-shirt kind of representing Cleanest Foundation on the day. And I said, we will all be going off at the same time, all part of the same group. And I said, the, the, the group is the Purple Platoon. They even have um, some training sessions lined up for the previous couple of weeks beforehand at 7 30 and the winds the morning out in you well if people want to get ready for this and you know i would say that you would need some bit of training you don't need a huge amount of it it's kind of just being part of the team and doing something for the foundation as well just absolutely ideal opportunity for people to do something i've asked all our other interviewees what's your favorite obstacle maybe for me the electric eels at the finish i know it's maybe a bit sad whatever you get a little bit of a shock or whatever but the fact that it's the last one you get through it you get all shocked through the body and then you're at the finish line your least favorite obstacle then is the next question um one which you call hangman um it's an 18 foot high rope where you got to try and get all the way to the very top and ring the bell i for one found it difficult to ring the bell last year our group did as well like but again really really tough obstacle so tj ryan limerick hurling manager sales manager here at q printing uh, patron of cleonas foundation thank you so much for your time <laughs>